Hi, my name is Tulani Kubeka, and I'm a photographer. My love for photography uh, started at a very young age. Growing up, we used to play outside a lot, and I used to see a lot of colors, especially on Sundays, you know? I'm as a CC, going to church. Um, people in general on a Sunday would like dress up. So um, growing up, then I, I like wanted to paint and draw, but then I couldn't. Eventually, my friend Kongi uh, bought a camera, and he was like, yo, let's take pictures of ourselves. That's where it started, and I've been painting with lights ever since. My uh, creative process uh, differs from, from set to set. You know, it's always different. Um, sometimes I'm listening to music, and I'd, I'd create my own music video in my head. Sometimes I'm walking down the streets, and I'm rearranging everyone's outfits in my head. But then they're all based off, I think one function that they all have is a feeling. Um, essentially, what I want to say with it as well is very important. Like, what does it say? What does the image say to me? So one of the bodies of work that we did was a body of work centered around um, punk rock in the black community and how you are like um, seen different or you like viewed different from, from someone else that's not in it. You know, if you're wearing black or if you're wearing chains or if you're wearing this, you're like specifically labeled, you're like immediately charged. So what we and the guys wanted to do, we wanted to challenge that stigma, you know, and just break it down. But then also play with the colors of, of black and white, you know. That's a bit of, of, of repetition in our work a lot of the time, just black and white. What drives my um, creative process is, is people, you know. I love talking to people, I love watching people. I'm a, I'm a bit of a, of a social introvert, if, you've, if that's even a thing, you know. I'm, I'm like only social if I have to, but then most of the time I'm just pulling back and I'm observing and I'm looking. You know, so that drives my, my creativity. So some of the challenges faced by um, creatives in, in South Africa is resources. We don't have a, a, a lot of resources, you know. So how I found out about designing Daba, I was scrolling through my computer. I was sitting at home just looking through images and browsing stuff. And then I saw a pop-up that said it, it, it was closing soon. And I think just two days before I applied, I just went through the page and the website and I saw uh, what it was doing for like uh, other creators as well, you know, whether it was design, whether it was architecture, seeing everyone that's been a part of, of Design in Daba, you know, like getting to showcase their work, you know, getting um, feedback about their work. And I applied and closed my eyes. Mm -hmm.